Hi there, my name is Amanda Downs and I am a registered dietitian with the Iredell Health System. Today I want to share some ways to enjoy the holidays without compromising your nutrition and to help keep you feeling great. I have five tips I'd like to share today. First and foremost, enjoy the holidays and all the special foods that come along with it. We have absolutely enough stress in life right now and food does not need to be another stressor. The holidays though are not a great time to set weight loss goals. It may be more realistic to focus on weight maintenance during this time. That being said, if you've been staying consistent with positive nutrition habits, we definitely want to keep that rolling. Consider making new dishes, breaking away from tradition, or trying different ingredients to make those traditional recipes a little bit lighter. Less butter, less sugar, and less salt are really good starting places. Tip number two, don't miss a nutritious meal twice in a row. For example, I recommend consuming breakfast, not skipping, and include a good source of protein at this meal. That could be something like a veggie omelet or a simple smoothie made with protein powder to start your day off right. Then maybe your midday meal ends up being a little larger in portion size or a little bit higher in calories. We would then want to make sure your dinner meal is not a repeat of that midday meal. That really helps you get back on track without depriving our bodies of the nutrition that it needs. Don't go long hours without eating. We tend to make up for this later on because when we finally do get a chance to sit down and eat, we're overly hungry and more likely to have a larger portion size. Tip number three, hydration. Every cell and tissue in our body requires an adequate amount of hydration. However, most of us tend to be poorly hydrated on a daily basis. This can be especially problematic during the busyness of the holiday season and can make us feel very tired and worn down. I would try to aim for at least 48 to 64 ounces of water daily. Keep a water bottle with you everywhere you go, in the kitchen, in the car, on your desk at work. So that water bottle is out as a visual reminder to keep on sip, sip, sipping all through the day. The calories from sugary drinks can really add up fast. So I would try to avoid soda, sweet tea, fruit juice, and alcohol as much as possible. Our body does not know the difference between liquid calories and solid calories. It just knows that if it's getting too many calories, it needs to store them for later. Tip number four, don't let leftovers linger. One meal or even one day of off track nutrition is not going to be problematic, but when that day becomes a week and then two to three weeks and then a month, we may find ourselves really struggling to get back on track. So prepare those favorite recipes once a year, but scale down the recipe size so that leftovers aren't lingering. Or you can also offer to send leftovers home with family members or freeze them for use later on. And finally, tip number five, have a daily oxygen cocktail. Get outside, sneak in some short walks, and get some vitamin D from that sunshine. This takes some of the focus off of the food and can help you feel more energized and positive. Thank you and best wishes for a healthy holiday season.